Well, let's move to Lesotho now, where the ninth parliament of the country has elected Nkloi Motsamai as Speaker of Parliament. Motsamai makes his return after being Speaker in the seventh parliament. While well, also sworn in the newly elected 120 members of parliament after being summoned by King Letsi III. When the final results were announced last week, former Prime Minister Pakadita Mosidi's uh, Democratic Congress signed an intent to enter into a coalition with Deputy Prime Minister Motejwa Metsing's Lesotho Congress for Democracy and five other parties there. Well, the Speaker will formally begin the process of presiding over the election of the new Prime Minister. Well, our reporter, uh, Palesa Moeti, is uh, tracking those proceedings in Masero, and she's live on the line now. Uh, uh, good afternoon, Palesa, and uh, thank you for your time on the PM News Desk. Mm, Palesa, are you with us? I'm with you, yes. Good. How was the new Speaker of Parliament uh, received by political parties in the House today, Palesa? I must say the new speaker has been well received. Um, when we spoke to one of the um, members of parliament, um, from the co one of the coalition members, um, they, said they actually commended how smooth the whole election process went and also, um, you know, the swearing in of the members and the election of the speaker and the deputy speaker. They say that perhaps, you know, how the, the fact that the, the, all the processes went so smoothly um, could represent a new beginning for the future where, you know, violence would be a thing of the past when, um, you know, elections have just passed. So um, it's, there's a lot of hope that I sense that, you know, this is the beginning of a new chapter, you know, of peace and stability in the country. Mm. Uh, Palesa, when can we expect the formal process of electing the new prime minister to begin? Well, I know that the um, inauguration is supposed to happen on the 17th of March. Um, so I'm told that um, the, the new speaker is, about, is supposed to actually, as from today, kickstart that process of, you know, getting the new um, prime minister um, inaugurated as well. Mm. Uh, what is the state of play now, Palesa, between uh, the police and the army? Uh, we know that the coup last year left these two security apparatus uh, highly polarized, uh, and cooperation between the two will be critical uh, for any future stability. Well, today, from um, what we could observe, there's, um, we could say that there's, there's, there's peace between the two parties, you know, both the police and, and the army. Um, both of them kept an eye over the proceedings today, and there seems to be cooperation. And also just to add that the South African police um, is also very highly involved because they were there as well, just to also beef up security and see to it that all the processes run smoothly. So, um, yes, there is definitely cooperation at the moment. Palesa Murti on the line to us uh, from Maseru in Lesotho.